Hey world, I'm back again to truth. My topic of the day is repent. I'm going to get straight to it. This is for the children of Israel, which is black, Latin, and native Indians. No matter a per what a person done to you, don't seek revenge. You got to leave it to God. Yeah, you could be happy when you get a revenge, but like an hour or two later, you'll be feeling the same way. Feeling the same way. Just leave it in God's hands. I was speaking to a brother. He was like, yeah, I know a lot of bullshit happened to you, man. Just repent. Because I see you be trying to get revenge on everything that happened to you. I see that. Just got to let go and let God handle that. I'm working on it. And I know I was trying to get revenge. But once I got into the truth, I should have let a lot of things go. But I still was holding on to shit. After I just got out of the um, the IUIC camp, it don't make sense. Let go and let God handle that. And um, leave the revenge in God's hands. Because God is not a such thing as karma. It's called God. Let God handle that. From this day moving forward, I'm not seeking revenge no more. I'm going to let God handle that. And I'm going to let a lot of things go. I'm going to forgive, but I will never forget. If I'm going to love my neighbor like I love myself, I should not be showing no hate for no revenge. I'm going to just forgive it. Move forward. There's a chance I might not fuck with you. It doesn't mean I, I'm, 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 I'm being evil. I just don't got to fuck with you. Moving forward, let go and let God handle that. And um, keep the Sabbath day holy. No buying, no selling, no cooking, no working on the Lord's Sabbath day. Knowing today is a double Sabbath. Um, even when it get dark, you still can't buy nothing, but you could cook. And you could work, but one thing you can't do is buy. Keep that in mind. It's the first month of the year. Um, um, it's the first month. I'm mean, the first day of the month. June 1st. You can't buy. Once again, Sunday. Basically, Sunday. Sunday night, you can buy. And you can work. But you can't buy. You can cook. But you cannot buy. That was an eye opener for me today at the camp. 
It's all about keeping God, God's commandments. I'm a sensitive person. I take things serious. That's why nobody can't really play with me out here. Because I'm not playing with nobody out here. And um I got I gotta I gotta let things go. I'm working on it. I'm not perfect yet. But I'm working on to be perfect. Because the law of the Lord is perfect. The law of the Lord is perfect. Converting your soul. That means you could be perfect in God's eyes when you keep God's commandments. You can't be perfect if you're out here doing wicked shit. It's impossible. I'm working on being perfect. It ain't a such thing. Yes, it is. It's in the Bible. And um, I'm learning to let things go. Not to um, seek revenge. Learn to um, forgive but not forget. And learn to just be peace with people. That's I'm working on it. And, and it's, it's all about loving your neighbor like you love yourself. I love myself and I love my neighbor. So if I'm not trying to seek revenge, I'm going to make sure I love my neighbor and don't want nothing bad to happen to my neighbor. I'm working on it. It don't happen overnight. And it'll be six months me keeping... Like in a couple of weeks, it'll be six months of me keeping the law, statutes, and the commandments, keeping the Sabbath day holy for six months. And six months not smoking. I'm doing a pretty damn good job. I've been going through a whole lot of stuff, and I still didn't go back to smoking. That means I'm doing something right. I just got to do everything right. That's all I got to say about that. It's all about repenting. And moving forward, that means I can't do it no more. And I'm not. That's all I got to say about that. Good day. God bless. Peace. I am the truth.